sometimes they say, you know, we'll sit back and have a good laugh one day about this, but we'll never, we'll never have a good laugh about this. This is something that sucks and forever changed my life, you know, for the good or for the bad, you know, we'll, we won't know. You know, my first instinct, I got really scared. Just it was a gut feeling that we don't want to be doing this. I remember running up the stairs, kind of hooting and hollering, and Madeline Martinetti stopped me and said, Rich, problem. Kerry was a kind of wrestler that you could never count on. The thing about Kerry is he wanted to be great. When he did lose, he was visibly upset, visibly shaken, you felt helpless, you felt wrong, and you really felt like Fila had something against the United States at that point. I remember thinking we need to get the video, we need to go, we need to take this to a different level. I went right to Rafi Martinetti's room and said, you know, you have to explain what happened. Another FILA bureau member came over and whispered something in his ear. He turned to me and he said, I'm sorry, Mr. Bender, I must uphold the decision of the refereeing commission and shut the video. You know, they took away his opportunity to be a world champion. Did this really just happened. To this day, it's the biggest injustice I've ever seen in international wrestling.